Number 10. The first side of a triangle measures x. Not sure what it is. The second size, side of the triangle measures 9 more than whatever x is. And the third side of the triangle is twice the length of the first. The perimeter of the triangle is 25. Write an equation showing the perimeter of a triangle. Well, the first thing you need to do is remember that perimeter is simply the measure, the sum of the measure around the triangle. Let's sketch a little triangle here and label the sides. So the first side is some length x, we're not sure. The second side, and it doesn't matter which one you pick, is 9 more than that, so we'll just add 9 to x. And then the third side is twice the length of the first. So in math, if we want to do twice something, we simply multiply and x is the length of the first. So perimeter means if we add up those lengths, then that measurement is the perimeter and we're told that that's 25. So we can just turn that idea into a math equation. So that's the equation when it says write an equation showing the perimeter of the triangle. There it is, because here's your perimeter and then here's the sum of the lengths which equal that. Now to find the value of x then you just use your solving skills to get x by itself. So we've got one, two, three, four x's on this side that we can combine. Now we want to get our numbers on the other side of the equation so we can subtract that nine and then finally since the four is multiplying by x we'll divide. So x equals 4, but more importantly, now we know the length of the first side of the triangle. And we don't know the units, so we'll just leave it as 4. The second side is whatever the first side is, plus 9. So our second side will be 13. And then our third side is 2 times whatever the first side was, and that's 8. Now, before we call this problem done, let's just do a little check. Because if we did our math correctly, when we add these and find the perimeter, we should get uh, 25. So 4 plus 13 is 17. 17 plus 8 is 25. 